Hello again my friends, Bungie's latest weekly update teased more surprises for players to look forward to. Here's what Deej said, Since we began fighting Oryx and his dark minions, new achievements and rewards have come to light. More surprises lurk in the weeks to come. So then, you can expect more new exotic quest lines to appear in Destiny's universe, similar to the ones that awarded players the Black Spindle and the Sleeper Simulant. I'll be sure to have you covered as soon as they go live. Now the other noteworthy piece of news from the weekly update concerns shotguns. When Destiny's next game update drops, the shot package perk that you see here will be removed from all shotguns to make them less lethal at extreme ranges. It will be replaced with either knee pads, which increases the distance of your slides, crowd control, which provides a 15% damage bonus for 3 seconds after you score a kill, or close and or personal, which increases melee damage by 25% after causing damage with a gun. Now the short package perk isn't necessarily gone for good, Bungie still to reintroduce it if it fits with all their other crucible tweaks. The update will drop sometime next week. And remember guys, on October 13th, both Tess Everest and the Iron Banner return to the tower. I've made two detailed videos explaining exactly what you can expect from these two arrivals. You'll find links to both videos in the description box below. And one more thing before I go. Feel free to give my Twitter account a follow, at More Console. If you'd like to receive Destiny news as and when it breaks, I've got you covered. Again, link is in the description box below. And that, my friends, brings us to the end of the video. Thumbs up if you enjoyed it, subscribe for daily Destiny content, and thanks for watching. <laughs> You beautiful bastards, and as always, a D-E-E, -E -E. until next time, Guardians.